Okay, so I'm going to be showing you some uh, Cloud Lift, which is a uh, new thing on OnLive, which is actually the only thing uh, they've ever come up with that I feel is very useful. So they finally came up with a uh, useful streaming service that doesn't involve you purchasing stream copies of games for full price and uh, streaming them and hoping that they don't get removed uh, or anything like that. So this service is a little different. It is basically you can actually stream your Steam library from the cloud as long as you have an internet connection anywhere to your mobile device or your uh, PC, Mac, or whatever it is that you use your crappy little PC, whatever, smartphone it allows you to play games that you own on your Steam library. And unlike uh, other offerings, this one doesn't require you to be on your local network. So, like Steam streaming that they're working on, that requires you to be on your local network. It also seems to require a bit of a, well, a better PC than, than I have, or at least secondary PC. My... Yeah, um, but yeah, so I'm going to show you basically what they have here for the Steam games. It, it, it won't let you, uh, right now, uh, I don't know if it ever will, but it won't let you uh, stream your entire Steam library. Right now, it's similar. The library is basically the same as it is on Steam. Uh, the library for your Steam games is the same as it is for OnLive right now. However... I do hope that their service gets bigger and um another thing is their pricing could be better. Uh it's fifteen dollars a month. Um uh, I think they could do better than that. Um right now we're gonna play some Mortal Kombat, so uh Mortal Kombat nine. Um and it, it works well on the T V, so yeah. But um yeah, but it, it this method I mean, you wouldn't... It would be cool. You could purchase games from Steam and not even have a computer that meets the specs of the game and just stream it. Um, and you get to own the game, too. I mean, not you may not own it the way you would own it if you had the physical copy with all the, the bells and whistles, but at least you have the digital copy, which, you you know, it's not like they can come to your house and take it off your your hard drive or something. If they do, just call the cops. <laughs> but anyways, I was getting to some of the cons. Oh yeah, like the um, the library is not good. The pricing could be better. Um, so yeah, but it's cool that, that you actually own the game on Steam. And you can just use this to stream it. Instead of that silly ass purchasing the uh, stream copies of games for almost full price, and then have those games end up more than full price <laughs> after time, because they never change the pricing. So, yeah, so this is um, Mortal Kombat. Now, the delay, I so far I haven't had a problem with delay, at least for this game. I only own this game. That's the only game I have. I actually bought it because of this, but also because I, I planned on buying it anyway, so I figured, what the hell, why not buy it now? I can actually now stream it to my television and uh, play the game on my TV. And I don't feel any delay like I do on the actual on-live games, so I hope that's just... I hope that's the way it's set, for the at least for the Steam games. When I tried to play some demos of the on-live games, they just was not going to work. It was... I tried playing Alien vs. Predator, and it was... too much delay to be playable. It'll make... You know, a lot of times it will depend on the person's, uh... What is it? Not preference. It always depends on your preference. Oh. I fucked up. I forgot the fatality. But no, I mean tolerance to uh, input lag. Like some people have trouble with input. I've heard people say they have trouble with input lag, input 
whatever, yeah, input something delay on uh, even the Xbox 360 and stuff. So, but um, so far for me, this has been fine, and I've had no problems. Uh, as far as the way it looks right now on my TV, it's kind of blurry. It's not horrible. Um, it doesn't, of course, look like it's com you know playing on a PS3 or you know straight from the PC, but it's playable. Like I said, it's a little blurry. Uh, may depend on your connection because this one's gonna more depend on your connection than like um, any of the local streaming uh, services. Um. Whereas most of those are really depend on your router more. Uh, I've played those. I've used streaming services like that with absolutely no internet connection at all. So I don't even know what I'm doing here. Oh crap! I gotta look up his fatality. Uh, you go to moves list. Uh, hit A. Go down to fatality. I'll probably do it wrong. Okay, up the middle, back, forward, down, forward, X. Let me make sure I get these buttons right. Back, forward, down, forward, X. Okay. No, it didn't. He jumped. Ah, oh, fuck you. Stupid D-pad sucks. Anyways, yeah, Nvidia Shield's D-pad kind of sucks. Instead of going forward, he jumps. Anyways. So this is Quan Chi. I don't know why I, I that's a habit to do that move after I knock him down. It's like what's that going to do? He's down. He's not going to walk into it while he's down unless he's some weird spider. He's going to do some weird spider move over to it just so that I can stab him to death. Right. And, and the game looks really good on the screen, though. Definitely. I mean, on the, the NVIDIA Shield screen, looks perfectly fine. Just, I think, when you when you use these kind of services on Android, um, when you play them on the TV, they're kind of meant for smaller screens, so they probably just aren't optimized for a television. So they get a little blurry. But uh, it definitely can be done. I'm doing it right now. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, depending on how picky you may be, uh, may be fine, it may not be. Uh, I forgot the friggin' whatever, I forgot the fatality. Something that ended in X. This is going to be the last uh, fight I do because I do have a time limit on my account. I can't really break because of some thing where you can you only use a phone number once a year or something like that. And that's the only way you can get large uploads. And now I'm just kind of like playing lazily. Right. Try to... It's late at night, so I'm spacing out of here. Bitch. Urgh! Whore. Hey, what the fuck? Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Oh, cool. Fuck! That's what I was trying to do. There you go. Stupid whore. Boom! 